This is a quick video on page breaks and how to keep your numbers in sequence for your pages after you have um, had a break. Um, not a tea break, but a, a page break. As you can see here, I've got this bit on here, which is uh, my footer. I want it like this, where this document doesn't have a footer. The reason I have that is that I want these documents to be printable um, and in a format that can be submitted um, to a government office. Um, the next problem is, once you've had page breaks, it goes back to page one, um, which is another problem. So let's get started. First thing you want to do is go to page, page layout, click on the page previous, not, not the page that I want the number six removed from. And what I want to do is click on breaks, then just get rid of it off the next page. As you can see, that's just jumped down a little bit, and it's gone. So that's perfect. That's the way I want it. Now I need to change this to page six. So what I do with that is right click, edit footer. Over here you see page number. So we want to change, format the page numbers, and this one wants to start at page five. Um, or it can continue from a previous section. You can do either of these, but it will start it from page five because it does the same job. So there you go. That's page six. And if we just click close header and footer, you can see that's page six. Line breaks are on one, two, three. They're perfect. And the numbers are all in sequence. Okay, thanks for watching.